TV. Hello friends, this is Eli from Mystic Circuits. Today I've got a litany of old things, including some that are coming back, as well as some new things. Um, I would say that as far as audio goes, we're very excited to have been making great strides in bringing back our old sequential switch module called Tree. We have a new prototype of it over here. It is more or less the same module, but it's way easier for me to build. So I'm hoping to, hoping to have them back in stock soon. There's also, you might notice, a new expander for it. Uh, Tree is an eight channel sequential switch, but Twig is a 4HP expander that adds two more channels of sequential switching to the host module. And uh, it does a couple of clever things. Um, first of all, having two channels that are tied together is useful for doing things like switching in stereo. You can switch uh, CV and gate sequence together so that you have a couple of preset uh, melodies that you've worked on ahead of time that you're then scrambling in interesting and algorithmic ways. Um, but it also has some really clever normalization going on where basically we can take uh, each node, each sort of like input output node that we're switching between and they all normalize down, right? So I have a couple of signals here. This first one that's plugged in is taking up these top four slots, right? So it's almost like I plugged into all four of them. And then the two switches normalize together. So it's acting like a sort of like tandem switch right now. And we can do some fun things like I can have an output selection on my right side and an input selection on my left side so I can do all kinds of weird stuff like I can have three inputs going to five outputs I can have two inputs where one input takes up six steps and the other one takes up two steps I can have all eight occupied but have them sort of individually switching together so there's a lot of really creative new approaches to switching that this enables that are all done by patching no menus or anything like that and uh, yeah, I'm hoping to have them available around the same time, if not quickly in succession of each other. Uh, the other new thing that I'm showing is a video module called Ruins. This is a quad video oscillator. It's designed to make video synthesis more affordable by both combining a couple of units into the same uh, module and also by using inexpensive parts wherever we could get away with it. Um, it, there's a lot of transistors and CMOS in there in places where a traditional video module might use op amps or VCAs. And um, it's able to do a lot of things that are particularly uh, kind of chunky and glitchy, whereas your traditional video module is going to give you all this beautiful gradual control. You know, these are the things that we love video modular for. Uh, our, our video module is what's giving you all of these sort of like distorted, uh, evil, tropical fish shapes that are interacting with each other. And uh, this is nice for a couple of reasons. Um, sometimes you want something that's a little bit dirty. Uh, there are ways to avoid that. Um, if you patch it in particular ways, but I find that having something that is clean most of the time, but is able to get you into particularly grungy territory in certain scenarios is sort of like a happy medium that I like to go for. Um, you can get a lot of detail with all of these different oscillators working together. And uh, also sometimes you need just an extra couple of oscillators in order to modulate um, other things going on in your rack, you don't necessarily want to use your fancy $500 oscillator in order to just make an LFO or horizontal lines. This module gives you four of those for, I'm shooting for 500, I'm hoping to release it in the spring, sort of waiting to see what the market looks like as new tariffs come in. Uh, but yeah, um, this is a production prototype, so it's going to beta testers. Hopefully that means it will be done soon. To find out more about modules from Mystic Circuits, please visit their website and check out the description below this video. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe to CatSynth TV. You are watching CatSynth TV.